Hey, you're watching MixGarage.com and today we're going to be testing out the Pompa Aspirolio, which means uh, oil extractor pump. So basically what this does, um, it's a tool for uh, helping you to service your car uh, and it sucks the oil out of the engine rather than you having to drain it out of the bottom, which can be kind of messy. And if you're working at home on the driveway, then something like this can save you a lot of time, effort and mess. Right, so let's give it a try. I've never used one of these before, so uh, we're going to be finding out how it works together. So basically you hook it up to the battery, it's 12 volt. Um, it has an off and on switch on it as well. So let's get it hooked up first of all. You do this with the engine warm as well. The oil needs to be nice and hot. So don't try it with the, uh, with the engine cold because it won't work. Plus to, uh, or red to positive and black to negative. So that's on. Um, yep, we have it on the right way. So what you do is you remove the dipstick, give that a wipe and put it somewhere safe. And then you've got to get the thinner tube in the oil extractor and feed it all the way down as far as it will go. So now the extraction tube is all the way down into the, uh, the dipstick pipe and now you need to get a container that's uh, bigger than the oil capacity of the engine. So this one takes 3.8 litres, so we've got a 5 litre container here, so it should be fine. And at the end of this pipe, put it into here. Last thing to check, just make sure you have the direction of flow correct. So oil coming in here, going out here. Then just turn on the pump. So once the oil started to run dry, you'll be able to see clearly because the pipes are clear. Um, you can remove the uh, oil container and and then extract the, the smaller pipe as well. And just give them a good wipe down so you're not getting oil anywhere, like we are there. And then just unclip the battery terminals. Okay, so we've extracted all the oil from the engine um, and it's actually a bit quicker than I was expecting. It took about seven or eight minutes which is probably less than it's going to take you to jack up the car, put it on axle sands and then drain the oil out uh, in the traditional way. So that's pretty good. Now just put the dipstick back in and uh, under normal circumstances what you'd be doing now is changing the filter as well. But this car has only been serviced a month ago and we're just, the point of the video is to show you the, uh, how the extractor works. So we're not going to change the filter, we're just going to simply top the oil back up. Obviously it's important not to run the engine um, when you've got no oil in it so obviously that goes without saying but when you've um, you know not got all the tools in the engine bay that you normally would it can be easy to forget that so that's it just check your uh, level with the dipstick um, and replace your oil filler cap and you're done uh, oil change in less than 15 minutes